Hey guys, Jonas95 again. This time we'll look at another Mayman Foley Shards review. This time we'll look at the Mayman Foley Shards Series 1. It is Airman. Now, this is Series 1 from Jack's Physic from 2019. Now, I'm gonna honestly, before I look at this package, I'm gonna have this character look at Airman. This is the biggest controversial for right here. I was not a fan of Airman's design. I am not a fan of for redesign for Airman. When the very first when the first time I saw the the poster from the Comic Con that was that one air robot it was thinking, Oh, that's not Airman, but it turns out it's true. When in later the episode called the Run and Wild, where Airman finally first appears, show up and oh god, that is probably the worst redesign I've ever seen. He's kinda of straight out of Cubics characters. I was not a fan because he has air on his shoulder instead of stomach. I was rather prefer to stick with the original one. Has more very classic looking. Like has stump air conditioning in his chest. I don't want to get it rented about the, the rent. So anyway, he was actually working for the Sergeant Knight. He was trying to take down the feats of trying to defeat Mayman, Man, but it failed. It failed twice. So he did first with first appearance episode Running Wild. He didn't make appear from air to the robot. I gotta say, he's one of the worst episode I've seen. When he was defeated by him, he was in, says air is going in space. He flies up to space, but then all of a sudden, Airman just accidentally flows away to space. He has never seen him again. But, but he later appears episode of, I can't remember saying where Megman got Guzman's neck. Airman just appears like, hey. The airman is supposed to stay in the space. That's my big theory. So, I won't talk about spoiler that then. What? So anyway, so here is Airman. It's got the same package as the rest of the other guys. So here is Airman. Airman. It's got all the same package. It's got a little image of Megaman on it. It's got all the same it says name on it. It's got a sign that says "Collect the Connect." That was a cannon, not the builder figure. He comes with a little something piece. And you can see it's got a little, some kind of fragile damage package. On the back, it shows there was no bio, unfortunately. It comes with his Air Busters, I think, also known as Airman Schematic. Shows a little how to the feature of the gimmick. <coughs> and shows the other rest of the figures. Shows all the rest of the figures. Shows the rest of the line. And it's made by from Jasmine from 2018. So anyway, let's take this out. Let's get it open up. Let's take a look at Airman. box so here is the airman out of the package now the first time we acquire he comes with a little back piece goes to I think that goes connect to his bag of holes peg it goes to here it goes to connect that won't come out this next over here we got this air conditioning I think that's supposed to fans move but Nope, it can't move. The fans did not move. That was a plastic. It's just a hard, just a plastic sculpt. It goes to uh, connect to his bowl joint. Now, this is going to pain in the butt. <clears throat> well, that didn't work. That worked. Yep, it works. <coughs> so here is Airman out of the package. So here is Airman out of the box, out of the package. Now I'm saying this figure looks pretty accurate with Saw Show. 
And like I said before, that was a big controversial redesign one. Also, I did not mention, there's one guy from Demon and Arts actually did make an uh, Airman's Foley Shard skin redesign from Blue One, the true one. You can check this out. So here is the Airman. Now, one of the surgery is comes with his Air Busters, or Airman Schematic, whatever you want to call it. Yeah, this pretty much is that. <laughs> here's. Now, for size of little comparison, here's next to Airman. Oh, sorry. Here's next to Mayman. This one is a little five and inches because of the big air condition. So I have, and Mayman should be Mayman should be smaller. From trying to take this up, let's go and then can fit. Let's go cannon, airman schematic that can blow his winds. So that's kind of cool as a feature gimmicks. So let's take a look at Airman. I think Jack Siddick did a good job how he looks captured from the episode. I like how his eyes are looks more in detail. He's got big eyes. This kind of reminds me from Cubix, like the what was his name that that one robot has digital eyes. Nice the details on it. I like how it has a head here as a top. It's, it's just a plastic. They're not hard rubber, just a plastic. Kind of hard plastic. Going back. So the shoulder air conditioning details. Not much, but. Darn it, see to one says. It's got a little hand details. It's got a little air conditioning. Shows a little hands. I think it always looks nice like the detail ones. It's got all shoulders. He has all missing paint details. It's sort of be like, I think it's green. I can't remember. And there's little boots. And there's robotic boots. Shows a nice detail on the back. And on the bottom then, sadly, there's no peg holes. That was really unfortunately. My only biggest complaint was I have is a, his shoulder cans feels a there was an air condition. If you want to make a pose of like a flying this, the air condition looks like it's gonna pop. This articulation for airmen, which is really unfortunately for this. The head does not. There's no head, and sadly there's no head. The head does not turn. No head articulation. It would have been a cool one. It should be like a waist joint. It would have been awesome. It should have just turned waist. Make a head turn. Shoot it. It shows a waist turn. That would be awesome. Turn head turns. Anyway. His arms goes up and down. Goes in and out that much. It goes the same. This one feels loose. And sadly, there's no elbow, no elbow articulation. That's kind of sad. It would be cool one should be like banner articulation elbows. And sadly, there's no wrist articulation, no wrist articulation. That was a disappointment. This leg is forward and back it goes, it goes in on that much. There's not the thigh so. He has a bend in the knee. Rotate around. He has a bend in the knee, bend in the knee, so this one just feels loose. This leg just feels loose. Also his air condition, which is a bowl joint, makes it look like it's flying. Has a nice little bowl joint, engines, that was kind of cool one. So that is Airman's from, so that is Foley Char's basic figure, Airman. Overall, this actually looks cool, and like I said before, that was, I was not a fan of Reed's Airman. Oh, I forgot, there was the episode of the, a camera saying that, the lights camera action, the one he meets, Airman has a blood or a sister. 
I've never seen it. it was like, holy crap, man. Airman has a daughter, has a sister or blooders? Yeah, in the game, Airman was never mentioning his blood or his sister. So, anyway, that's kind of weird. So, anyway, that is the basic figure Airman. Hopefully, you enjoyed this one. If you find this figure at the local, some, I got this at a Christmas one. I think it's from Amazon, I believe. Or right on eBay. Apparently, the Target is already sold out just too late. So, apparently, the case. You might as well hard looking for it. So anyway, hopefully you enjoyed this one. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. So thanks for watching and goodbye.